Tammy and I am on my way to um, a town called Kokomo. We have to, we have a meeting there. So I am, all of the leaders are meeting there to meet. <laughs> it's a leadership development class thing. There's a farmer's market, not a farmer's market, an Amish market right there that I may have to stop on, stop at on the way back. Oh my goodness, I've stopped there before and they have wonderful stuff. So I know they have this cheese bread that is so good, but so bad for you. And I am yawning. I apologize for being yawning. It is 7.47, so I shouldn't be yawning, but I am. I need to color my hair. I can see that it's getting whiter and my eyes are getting worse because I don't have my glasses on and I can barely see myself. I mean, I can see myself. I can see that I'm there. I can't see any details. Like I can see that there's white like right over here. And I think there's probably white over here because that's where I get white right here, here and here. So I'm assuming that there's some over there, but I really can't see on that side right now. Um, and I can see I have a necklace on, which is new. So that's kind of different. That's new. Mm, I'm getting older. Mm. I have a birthday coming up. Today is my friend Tracy's birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Tracy. Happy birthday to you. Her name is Tracy Plants on YouTube. So if you get the opportunity, check her channel out and wish her a happy birthday. I am really having fun making memory decks cards right now. I don't know if you guys know what those are because I did not and I did do a video that I will post. I think it's posting early next week maybe about them and um, what was I going to say? They are like put them in like a Rolodex. I'll just tell you real quick what they are. And they're just the cards that you decorate and make pretty. I mean, it's nothing too special, but they are so fun to make. It's kind of like the pocket letter thing where those are fun where you're making nine little different things, which are also fun to do, or the envelope thing. It's kind of like that, you know, it's a total non-necessity, but they're pretty and they're cute. And um, a group of my friends and I are doing swaps. So we have little swaps going on and um, I think it's gonna be really fun. I know it's gonna be really fun. I've made one that I did do a video on so you guys will see that. And then um, Ellen and Susan and Lisa and Tracy and me are the ones that are in the group. And it's the ones that have met together for coffee and stuff. And we're going to do that once a month. We're so excited. This is really, I think, going to be an awesome friendship. I, these gals are, it seems like we've known each other for a lot longer than we have. And it's just been fun. So uh, we're, we're planning some fun stuff and just having fun, which is so nice. I think we all needed some friendship. So it was cool. And Tracy and I are still best of friends. She was hoping to come back down before she had to start back to work because she was, I know I told you guys this, but if you don't remember or if you didn't hear the last time or whatever, you forgot, it doesn't matter. She was laid off of work, but now they've called her back. So she gets to start this week or this coming next week. She was hoping to come back down one more time before she had to start again, but she's not gonna be able to. So that's a real bummer, but that's okay. We love her anyway like we would because you can't come we don't love you anymore no. but we miss you like crazy and I say we because I'm including all the gals and Taz and Fuzz and Jamboni who she fondly calls Beyonce he's a little bit extra um, and Lisa and I still have our standing once a week date um, I can call it a date of a silly thing to call it I guess but I don't know it's a girl we get together we have coffee I've been going to her house we're watching a million little things we started over from the beginning oh my gosh I just love that show if you guys haven't seen it check it out I love it and she loves it so we're having fun watching that together and then we'll knit and she does plastic canvas or whatever and it's just so nice to have 
these friendships and without YouTube I wouldn't have it so thank you so much I really really I mean I wouldn't know any of these gals if I didn't have this channel so it's awesome I am blessed beyond beyond definitely blessed more than I deserve for sure um, so yes I really appreciate it and I'm not gonna get all sappy I have this meeting until 430 today I just don't sit well <laughs> in one spot for so long and I have a feeling that they're going to have assigned seats it's at a convention center and they don't always but when it's tables like that they usually do seem to have assigned seats and we've not had it at this place before so I'm not exactly sure what to expect but I have a feeling it will be assigned seats and bleh and I'm getting there later than I wanted to so not assigned seats necessarily but assigned tables I mean I'll still be there in time and just not as early as I had hoped I had to stop and get gas and then I got some Yankee coffee which I'm still drinking because it's the only coffee I have but it's not that great It's really bad. Bleh. Not good at all. And I'm not super picky about things, so I must be pretty happy for me to complain. This is so bad that if I had got it at a restaurant, I would ask to get something else. I don't ever do. But I would be like, ugh. But I'm still drinking it because it's all I have. wrong with it either. I was trying to figure it out. I mean, it doesn't taste like anything bad. Like nothing. It's not the cream that's spoiled or anything like that. It's just it's regular coffee with French vanilla cream, but I'm not enjoying it. I didn't have a very big selection. I kind of thought that there's a gas station by us that has like lots of different selections of coffee and they always have like a flavored coffee sometimes it's pumpkin you know it um, in the fall and right now I don't know what flavor it is but it's probably something you know cinnamon hazelnut something I'm not a big fan of hazelnut but uh, this place didn't have any flavored coffees they did have flavored creamer but no flavored coffees at all which was kind of odd to me but they did have brewed cold coffee I wasn't sure how that worked. I should have maybe tried that because it may have been better than this. We have a light and it's green and nobody's going. Ugh, yeah, this is awful. <sighs> Good thing I got the big one. Um, what else is going on in my world? I'm just really enjoying my new friendship and I'm still knitting away but I'm not knitting as much because I found these paper crafts that I'm enjoying again so I'm kind of breaking up my craft time between knitting and watching television uh, like knitting and watch television at the same time and then paper crafting and even either videoing that for you guys or I'm listening to an audiobook one of the cozy mysteries I love it. So that's what I'm looking forward to when I get home tonight. I want to listen to my mystery and work on the uh, memory decks cards. So they're quite fun. And we're making one for each. So 
I kind of, I don't always have it like an assembly line, but that seems to work best for me when I come up with an idea, I just do it to all of them. Although sometimes I don't think it's bad to have them similar, same theme, same everything, same colors, same concept, just a little different each one, of, but I haven't done that yet. I've only made one um, and I've started another and I've started a third. So I, I am waiting to get some more inspiration for the second. I have the main part of it done, but I still have the inspiration for the background and all of that still coming in my head. I haven't come up with it. And then the one I'm working on right now, I think I have all the pieces and parts. I just need to put it all together. So it's really cute though, if I say so myself. And the colors are really pretty. It's like pink and dark blue and lighter blue and a bright pink So and white. So they're pretty colors. I'm also using a little bit of craft cardstock in it. Sometimes I get inspired by colors. Other times it's the like the the design or what's the word I'm looking for? Like the image, the main part. I often get inspired by that more often than colors. But when I get inspired by colors, I love it because then I can just go crazy with those colors. And these are fun for me because I have so many supplies and some of it I'm so bad at using and I'm trying hard to just use the stuff that I have because I have a lot and I don't need to hoard it. I need to use it. So that's what I am trying to do. And so far I've gotten a little better at it. I don't know why I think I really like this so I don't want to use it. That doesn't make any sense. And when I think about it, and say it out loud, I know it doesn't make sense. But in my head, I know that if I use it, I won't have it anymore and I want it. So I, that's, it's really crazy. I know that I'm not alone in that, but it's just a weird way of thinking. Because I could use it and make somebody else happy too. Or I could use it and make it for myself, do something for myself with it if I really want it. But I am getting a rush of ideas of things to do, which is fun because I have ideas for some Christmas presents and I have some ideas for these decks, memory decks cards. I call them MD cards, so hopefully if I say that, I'll remember. And then, you know, the inspiration for my traveler's notebooks and all of that is coming to me and it's been great, so I'm really excited about that. So that is a nice thing. Gosh, the sun is coming out. I cannot believe that it has been snowing so far into the month. I mean, I can believe it. It happens, but it seems like it's, like, I don't know, it seems like it's late. Snow, 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 it snowed yesterday. And it's not just, I mean, it's, it's not sticking to the street or anything because it's still too warm which is nice but it does there's some on the grass well whatever you can call it it's not doesn't look like grass it's brown on the brown stuff that's supposed to be green um but it's crazy because oh hold on that says cook them up that way so I think I need to get over although you know what this doesn't tell me to I better just stay here I'm just gonna listen to my GPS She talks to me still when I have this on. I know that. I know she does. So I'm not going to fret. I will just go straight. Although I am fretting. So I'll probably, yeah, I'm going to stop this and make sure I'm going the right way. <laughs> All right, I am going the right way. But I think I'm going to let you guys go right now anyway. Maybe I will continue it on my way home. The sun is just really bright and I just need to make sure that I am heading in the right direction to get there so I will talk with you all soon if I end this now then hope you have a great day and I will talk to you soon bye bye hello everyone so I am gonna vlog just a little bit on my way back 
the meeting was good and even nice was there was a Sonic there. I never get Sonic, so I have a Diet Cherry Limeade and it is like mixed to perfection. I forgot that they actually put lime like in it. It's amazing. Oh, and this ice, it's the little baby crushed ice. My favorite. Oh, but my bunion is just now killing me. Ooh, I might have to kick off my boot. Yes, that's what I did. I have 27 miles on this road before I get onto a different road. Oh, this is good. And it's probably gonna make me burp, so I apologize if I get burpy. Oh, I can feel it rumbling in my tumbling. Woo, rumbly in my tumbly like Pooh Bear. <sighs> I don't feel like cooking dinner tonight, so I think I'm just gonna go home and make my, or play with my decks, memory decks. I did go to Hobby Lobby uh, because there was one on the way, like right across the street from the Sonic, so I thought, okay, I'm gonna try this place. There was nothing. I mean, it's just, I don't know. I am not happy with Joanne's. I think I told you that I went there. I had placed an order online. I ordered 11 things. And four of the things I was supposed to be picking up at the store, the remaining seven they were supposed to ship. I get notification that my order went through. They charged my card, all of it. I get to Joanne's. I go there on that snowy day, as I told you guys, to pick it up, and lo and behold, they have one item of the four that I was supposed to pick up there. Then I get home, and I have an email with canceled order from everything that I had, everything else that I had ordered that was supposed to be shipped from online. They, it was $103, they had nothing. So why did they let me go to the store and look? I mean, I could have saw, seen if they had anything like that at the store because I didn't look for it since I knew I'd ordered it online. And second of all, why in the world do they not have what they advertise? It's so aggravating. And the store said that they had all of those things, including one of them was a memory dex holder that I really kind of, I really did want. And actually I had even told Lisa about it we were both gonna get one. They didn't have them. So I checked this store and they said that they had nine, I think, maybe seven in that store. There was a zero. Then they were supposed to have um, them at this store as well. None. At least I couldn't find any, nor could I find an employee to ask, and nor would they even know what the heck I was talking about if I tried to explain it to them because that's just a nightmare. So I am done with Joanne's, I think. I am just not happy with them. It doesn't seem like they have anything that I want. And then, I mean, they have some nice things. I'm not gonna say that they don't have anything that I want, but I mean, with this experience, they have nothing that they advertise that I order even. That's ridiculous. And then I think their prices are high. I was gonna get a thing of stickers, but it was $4.49 for this little Joelle's sticker thing. And they're 40% off, so I would have gotten 40% off, but it was still almost $3. And I'm like, you know, I'm just not doing it. They were little Christmas lights that I wanted to use on a memory dex card, but I can just draw Christmas lights and use my fun paints or whatever glittery things to color them in if that's, I mean, for real dollars for these little stickers I mean they were cute but they weren't all that so I don't know I'm kind of I'm thinking that Joanne and I are on the outs I'm glad I still like Michael but Joanne oh there's that Wilson farm 12 miles now I'm not even thinking I want to go eh, I just kind of want to go home We'll see how I feel when I get closer, but I'm thinking no. I'm thinking no. Um, what else? And the Hob and I will always get along, I think. They know how to have a sale. 
and I like that they have sales in routine. I don't know what the word is that I'm looking for, but it's like, if it's not on sale this week, it'll be on sale next week or the week after. So don't worry, you know, kind of like that. I don't mind that at all. FCA, it's a huge big building. I don't know what that means. FCA, transmission. There's no T in it at all, but it says FCA Transmission. So I don't know what the FCA stands for. Guess I'm not supposed to know. Oh, I thought that was another Sonic, but it's not. It's a gas station. <laughs> I'm getting all excited about Sonic just because we don't have them close to me. for singing a dumb song. That's It's not a dumb song, but I like me some Lionel. Long time ago, I liked me some Lionel anyway. I mean, he's still all right, but it's not somebody I say, hey, let's listen to Lionel Richie. Mm. But if he came on the radio, I'd sing along. All right. <clears throat> I think I'm going to let you go and listen to my audiobook. And I will talk to you all later. Bye.